Hey guys, it's Holly. Today I have the Spring 2020 Pushing Box. Now, this box is a little bit late, obviously, because of all the craziness going on. It got pushed a little bit, but we finally have it, and I'm very excited. I will put all the information about this box down below in the description, but let's go ahead and get started. This is the box. It's super pretty. I believe, if I'm not mistaken, that this whole box is going to be plant-themed. This box is really heavy, so I'm going to guess there's at least a few ceramic plant items in here so let us see <gasps> Ooh, yes so the first thing i see is this really pretty pattern and then a card that says sprout how cute okay i'm gonna try not to look at the back i got a little bit of a peek so the first thing in here it says is a robe and i think i actually saw a spoiler about this i think it's like a silk robe which is very exciting it is 100% polyester, so. Ooh, this is fancy. Oh, I like it. It has a pocket. Ooh, ooh I like it. Ooh, 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 I feel so fancy. I don't have anything like this. It almost kind of feels like lingerie, like not gonna lie. Lingerie. Okay, well, I love this. Super fancy. It feels very luxurious. Then we have this, which is an incense holder dish. I had incense a long time ago, like when I was in high school, and I didn't really like it that much because it's just really, really strong, and I have really sensitive senses. This is really cute though. You could totally use this for something else. It doesn't have to be incense. This is really cute. So there's like a little hole in it right here. Like is that where you put the incense stick maybe? There's also like a little speck right here that I can't get off but this is really cute. I like the pusheen holding the little branch. You could totally put like your keys or jewelry or something on this. Then we have this, which says it's a mini wall tapestry. Oh my gosh, this is so pretty. <gasps> this might be the most like elegant pusheen box we've ever gotten. Like this is so like sophisticated. Like pusheen is just bringing the level up in sophistication, you know? This is super pretty from far away. Would you be able to tell that this is a pusheen pattern? Like, this just looks like something really pretty, like maybe from Ikea or something. And then you get closer and then like, oh, there's little pusheens hiding in it. So it says it's a wall tapestry. There's like these two um, holes in it. This could easily be like a handkerchief or like, I don't know, like you could use this for something else. Oh, these are so, this is pretty. Absolutely beautiful. I like it. And then on top of this, like, like even this, you can't really tell that there's pusheens on it till you get really close, I feel like. I really like that. Okay, I like it. I like it a lot. What is this? This is why the box is so heavy. This is a heating pad. And this is the kind of heating pad that has like the beans in it. And you put it in the microwave. We used to have one of these when I was a kid. Use this heating pad to soothe aching muscles and joints when you just need some warming up. Can also be used for cooling. Oh, it has sandstone in it. So this is basically like a little bag. This is a super cute pattern too. Like I'm loving all the pusheen designs with this. The back is really soft, like it's like a velvet. And then this is like more like a canvas and you can open it here and take it out and put it in the microwave. I totally remember having, we had one I'm pretty sure that had rice in it when I was a kid and my mom would put it in the microwave. So this is totally reminding me of that, but this is really cool. I definitely will be using this the next time I get cramps, you know what I mean? Then next we have this, and I thought that something in the box was broken because it sounds like something broke. Oh, it did break. That's why it sounds like it's broken is because it actually, it is broken. It's, it's broken glass. That's why it sounds broken. Okay. I thought that maybe it was because there was something inside of this jiggling around, but no, like it actually broke. <laughs> that makes sense then. Okay. Well, I'm really scared to open this because if you guys have been following me for a long time, I did a video for a snack box a long time ago and they had included a glass drink in the box and it exploded and I got stabbed by glass from that box. So I don't want that to happen again. I'm gonna try to be really careful with this. It's a really cute bottle, but it completely shattered. Um, what was this? Oh, it was a tea infuser bottle. So it looks like it had the little tea infuser on the inside and then 
a whole other bottle it's like a double glass bottle in it and it shattered so that makes me really sad that it broke i think that with glass items like you really really have to package it super well and while they did like wrap it in this foam it it wasn't it wasn't enough i guess to keep it from breaking so that's very sad i don't drink tea anyway so i guess it's not really that big of a deal <laughs> then next we have the vinyl toy and it's pushing in a little plant which is so cute and i love it so much house plant pushing how cute so pushing is off of it right now but there you can just put her right there oh my gosh it's so cute oh my gosh i love it it's so funny. It, this is really big though. Like the, the vinyl figures are getting bigger and bigger. I don't know how we're gonna like store all these in the same place, but this is absolutely adorable. And I actually really like that you can take this off because this is like the size of the um, mini pushing figures that you can collect. And when I did my pushing dollhouse, I had one of these. So I could put this in my pushing dollhouse, which is really cute. And I'm very excited about it. Then next we have this, which is a notepad that says how I feel. And I actually am like really, really glad that this is in here. And I don't know if they included this because of everything that's been happening, like with quarantine. But I actually just really, really like this because it basically has a bunch of feelings up here. You can check how you feel, happy, excited, angry, silly, meh, lazy, super lazy, scared, and then they have a blank spot for you to fill in. And it says, I feel like this because, and I think that this is really, really important. I don't mean to like get really like serious right now, but I think that for me, especially right now, where everything's just like really uncertain and crazy and like I'm actually going through kind of a lot in my personal life. I feel like I try to avoid how I feel at all costs and I try to numb myself and I play Animal Crossing for hours on end and I try to just tune out everything that I'm feeling. But I think that this really will help me kind of be like, okay, what am I feeling? What am I trying to run away from? And just allow myself to feel that way. Because I think for me especially, I don't wanna feel my feelings. I know a lot of people don't wanna do that. We try very hard to avoid feeling bad feelings because they don't feel very good. I think it's important to feel your feelings, say that it's okay, it's okay to feel meh, it's okay to feel angry, it's okay to feel lazy. And I don't know, I just really, really like this. So yeah, I think I'm gonna definitely use this. I'm excited about it. I think it's a really, really cool item, like a mental health item. I like this, I like it a lot. Then lastly in this box is this really cute little tray with a pusheen in it. And the pusheen is like a different color on the wood. I don't know if it's like a stamp that they did or like a stain, it might be like a stain. This is so cute, it has little handles. So you can have like your tea or coffee or snacks or whatever you want. You could even use this to store like your mail or something like that. Very, very cool. I like it. Accessory tray is what it says. So yeah, you could definitely put like literally anything in here, jewelry, craft items. I could totally put like paints or whatever in here. I really like it. Okay, so that was everything in the spring pusheen box. I am very, very happy with all the items. I especially love this thing. Like, I feel so fancy. I love the tapestry, the patterns in this box. Like this is just like, next level pushing this is like adult pushing and i love it i love the vinyl figure super cute the little notepad is just it, it touches my heart because i think that it's just very important to acknowledge how you feel you know the heating pad i'll probably definitely use i'm really sad that the tea infuser bottle broke i think that mailing glass items and subscription boxes is really tricky and this is the second time in a subscription box that glass has broken and I'm really glad I didn't cut myself at least because before that was like glass all over the box in a candy box and it was really terrifying. So at least this was contained in the box, the box that it came in. But yeah, I feel like glass items in subscription boxes maybe just should never happen. I don't know. Unless it's like really, really, really well packaged, which that one honestly wasn't really that well packaged. And then the little trinket tray is really cute. So I will put all the information about this box down below in the description. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope that you're doing well and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.